And so today I've got a workout for your obliques. So I'm getting you to come and lay on your side, first of all. You can use a cushion or a pillow underneath your head and you're checking your legs are out in one nice long straight line. Top hand just in front for balance. I'm going to pull in as if I'm lifting the waist off the mat and harboring those legs off. So I'm feeling the work in the waist to lift, squeezing the legs together so there's a bit of work into those inner thighs as well. Breathing out as I lift, feel that work in the waist. So I'm working to give that definition, those lines down the side of the abs. Breathing out to lift, control that lever, and just stay as relaxed as you can in the upper body. We've got two more here, squeezing up, lovely. And then lowering down, we're gonna bend the knees, come up onto the elbow, hand down by the side, and we're gonna lift and squeeze the legs. So it's just a small lift, the hand reaches down, and I'm really working into the waist now as I do that. Stay lifted on the shoulder, try not to collapse there, and just squeeze into the legs, reaching the foot and hand together as you do that. Squeeze, use that breath, really getting that work into the waist. For two more, last one here, and then I'm straightening the legs out. My top leg is over the top, planting that foot down, shoulder directly underneath the elbow. We're lifting up and squeezing up and controlling down. So I'm feeling the work on this side now. Exhale to lift into the waist. Always feel your shoulder move down first, then the waist lift, and then the reach on this side. Good. I'm going to hold this one at the top, bring the hand to the side of the head, and squeezing the waist, lifting a little bit, and then opening out. It's a tough one, definitely feeling the sides of the body work now. Legs are squeezing together. One more on this side. And then releasing down, coming onto the elbows. So shoulders are down away from the ears. I'm going to tuck the pelvis under, pull the abs to come into that plank position. Check if not just to hitch the bottom to the ceiling. Slightly tuck under with your pelvis to feel the core engaged. Hips move to the floor, to the side, and then the other way. So I've got that work. Now really working through the whole core, but definitely into those obliques. If you need to rest, of course, sit back over the heels. We've got a couple more here. Rotate one way. Lovely. And then sitting back over the heels. Let that rest and relax. And then we've got it all to do on the other side. So laying out, use the arm to lay on or a cushion or a pillow. Legs are out in one straight line. Hand in front for balance. I'm going to squeeze the legs off and control down. So you might feel this almost straight away. You've already been working both sides when you were doing the work the other way. So that bottom inner thigh reaching along. Good. Feel the waist lifted off the mat as you squeeze and lower down. Exhale. Feel like you pick your feet up and try and put them down a little bit further away. Two more like this, squeezing up. And one more. And then bending the knees up on the elbows, slide the shoulder down. We've got that lift of the legs. Just a small lift. Try not to collapse into that shoulder, but feeling that waist really working. So the hand reaches to the feet. Slide the shoulder down. Keep the abs engaged in at the front the whole time. So we're really working all the core, but just with more of a focus into the waist on this one. Lift and squeeze. Exhale. Keep the shoulder away from the ear. You shouldn't feel like you collapse now towards it. Two more squeezes. Last one. 
and then let's stretch the legs out, cross that top leg over, shoulder down on this side, lift the hips and control that lower. So feel your shoulders slide first and you're lifting the hips as high as you can towards the ceiling as you lift, always controlling the lowering face. Tough move, two more squeezing up, one more here, and then the hand coming to the side of the head. Rotate in, pull the abs in, and open, and that pull in, control the movement. You don't need many of these, you'll feel that work now. In the core, one more, that lift, lower it down, and then just sitting in a comfortable position for you, Lift the arm to the ceiling, feel a gorgeous stretch. Lift into that arm, stretch the other way. And I hope that really worked and fired up those elite. 